I am in uh, southeast Kansas. I'm an area agronomist for them. My subject matter is agronomy, and I focus a lot on cropping systems and forages. So we have uh, a pretty diverse region in southeast Kansas. We have uh, about split 50-50 with crops and, and livestock, and uh, we have a diverse forage base in our area. We have a lot of fescue, tall fescue, and so there's all sorts of problems with tall fescue with endophyte infection and decreased cattle performance. Uh, with that, so a lot of my programming is centered around ways to mitigate uh, endophyte toxicity uh, with cattle grazing on on fescue. But we have a lot of brome, we have a fair amount of Bermuda grass, and we have quite a bit of native grass as well. And so we have quite a, a range of of different forages. And so the other uh, piece that really is a is a part of my extension program is the uh, the livestock integrated with the cropping systems as well and so we do uh, look at some cover crops and uh, their utilization as a alternative forage as well as we have uh, of course a decent amount of weed i go as far west as uh, south central kansas in my area and there starts to get uh, quite a bit more wheat grazing and so we spend a lot of time uh, looking at variety performance best uh, yielding wheats from the grain side but also we focus uh, some on the livestock grazing piece of, of weed as well and so a lot of my program really focuses around cropping systems forages and how they integrate and uh, and how that really fits into the the cap uh, grant that we're doing here is these mitigation strategies that we're we're dealing with with uh, adverse weather conditions.